Mosaics last for decades. Hopefully the ones we make will last for decades, if not centuries. We make them all over London. We've made lots down Globe Road in Bethnal Green. We do mosaics about anything. We did a beautiful one about the City of London. I'm doing it for 20 years in London. We work with communities, so on a project we could work with anything up to 600, 700 people. We've worked with 100,000 people so far. So people age 1 to 91. We've been at the ceramic workshop this morning and just talking about the wonderful mosaics at the girls' school. It's nice to see something pretty and more contemporary made with the children that are here now. We've got all these beautiful handmade tiles that the kids made, age two and three, and some of them on their first day at school ever. And here's the mosaic made by about 500 pupils with us over this term. And it looks fantastic. We work with a local blind school, which is called Joseph Clark, around the corner. We work with 100 children there who are blind or got visual impairments and other complicated disabilities. That one? That one? There's a big round blue circle. We had little tiles and what we do is we make patterns in it, pressing shapes into the tiles to kind of make a pattern. We started sticking different tiles together, letting the patterns kind of contrast. Enough. We talk to them about symmetry, we talk to them about geometric patterns, and we talk to them about experimentation. So children from year one, year two worked at the workshop using a variety of materials. There was lots of fine motor skills, all hands-on. It was just a lovely, fun day and the children really, really enjoyed themselves. And using stencils to very, very neatly draw around them, which the kids were brilliant. Here I am gluing down gold bits to make part of our mosaic. It's all multicultural fabric patterns representing nice. the different cultures that live in the area. I'm really passionate about ecology and nature. This is nine local moths and butterflies. Children photographed the leaves from the forest and then we got the photographs and had them made into high fire transfers. So it has to be high fired porcelain or stoneware or glass. Fired to 1280 degrees centigrade. Look at that, boiling hot. The very last bit we drop in are tiny little bits of gold and silver that are from Venice, same as you have in the cathedral roofs. What are you doing, Stella? Stella? <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I think I'm doing flowers or flowers, yeah. yeah. All these designs are going to be up outside our school for nearly you know, hundreds of years. It's like a once in a lifetime opportunity. One of the things that I pride myself on is a durability because I want people who have been involved who can take ownership and say that's my tile, that's what I made, I can go back and see it in 20 years time or 50 years time. This is one we did 15 years ago. We we'll often take the worst wall, so a wall that's used as an ashtray, it's full of cigarette butts, and we'll put the mosaic on there, a wall that everyone's forgotten about. People will stop vandalising a place if a lot of care is put into it. It involves the community. You're not just sticking something up that someone else has made, you're making something with everybody. This little girl is passing by, and she happens to have worked on both the butterflies. I'm going to give it a little wiggle like that. She thinks. You see children feeling it, people looking at the reflections in mirrors. I think it democratises art, it makes it free of charge and it's there every day for everyone to enjoy. I'm quite inspired by these mosaics here. They're absolutely beautiful. Everybody's stopping and revelling in the beauty that is now amongst them. It's definitely improved all from self. I've seen parents pointing their buggies with their babies, looking at the mosaics. My son, he wants to say what all the birds are. He says owl, he says peacock. This certainly jogged an awful lot of memories for me and some of the work that I used to do. I like the colours and the design of it. it. Should be more of these in the borough, brightens the whole area up. The kids have absolutely loved every bit of it. They've learned so much. I really appreciate this amazing mosaic. It's a brilliant. I loved it so much. I think it's beautiful what you guys are doing to these walls.